Hey guys, this is Russ, and now it's time for more Stern About Samurai. Let's continue. October 18th, right in cool offices. Phew, what a day. This is no time for relaxing, Nick! Say, you think WP's got a chance? I guess that really depends on the people we find out about today in today's trial. The director and producer? Yeah, them. Well, what are we doing here? Let's go to the studio! Let's go to the studio indeed! And find out about the director and producer. 2.16 p.m. Global Studios main gate. No one's here. Right. Now that Miss Old Bag's in custody, I guess they don't have anyone else to replace her. Hey! In the guard station! Look! She left her donuts! What? I wasn't going to eat them. You say you weren't, but I believe you were. Um, oh yeah, let's go check out Studio 2. Studio 1 entrance. Hey Nick, it looks like Detective Gumshoe isn't here today. You're right. He's probably up to his neck in paperwork after the commotion at today's trial. So Nick, remember that Studio 2 we heard about in, today, in the trial today? It was down the path of the fallen tree, right? Yeah, I think that's what they said. Maybe the director and the rest of them are there today. Now's our chance, Nick. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. The Studio 2. Studio 2 entrance. This is Studio 2? I thought so. It doesn't really look much like a studio, does it? No, that it does not. Hey, there's a trailer over there. It looks pretty sturdy for a movie set trailer. Are we sure this is a studio? Well, let's examine things. Is the door locked? Nick, let's go inside. You think that's okay? Oh well, it's locked. Aw, shucks. What about the window? On closer inspection, this trailer looks like it's been here for a while. I don't think this is a part of a temporary film set. Hmm. Okay, I guess the windows are locked too. What about these suspicious looking boxes? These look like materials for making a movie set. They've been sitting here for quite some time. This might as well be a junkyard. Hmm. Oh, we can do that, that dealio, or we can go the other side. Let's go the other side. Hmm. More lunch! Looks like two people ate here. There's nothing left on these plates. Hey, so they ate T-bone steaks too. What is it with steaks around here? Hey, there's always room for steaks. But something does seem out of place. What? I don't know. It just feels odd. Hmm. Is that, is that a furnace? What is that? An incinerator. Apparently they just put this one in. It's already covered in soot. They must not clean it much. Hmm. Alright. What about this van? A light van for moving staff and equipment around. They've kept it in pretty good shape. Looks like it'd run fine. Well, let's go for a drive. Sure. If I had a license. Nick, you don't have a driver's license. But look, I have this. Why are you showing me your attorney's badge, Nick? Because it's as good as a license? No. Oh. Hmm. So, no one's here at Studio 2. Maybe they're in the employer. Because, I mean, if you're an employee, then isn't that where you would hang out? Maybe. Maybe they're inside Studio One? No, no, no. Let's go check it. Studio One. I don't really want to be in here. Yeah, it is a murder scene. I want to go someplace else. Nick? <sighs> okay. Someone told me I should check out this ladder, so I guess I have to examine this ladder. Look! A ladder! That's a step ladder. So? What's the difference? You need to stop judging things based on the narrow-minded culture assumptions, Nick. But right. Sorry. <laughs> this girl is out of here. Out of there. Or she is out there. Because she's from out of space. Alright, let's go to the employee area. That's where my gut tells me to go. So let's go. Uh, main gate. And from the main gate, we go to the employee area. Yeah! Global Studios employee area. Look, it's that assistant girl. Hey. Oh, hey, Penny. Hi, WP's lawyers, right? I heard about the trial. Great job, guys. 
Oh. Oh, don't mention it. Is it true that they caught the security lady? Oh, 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 actually, she just called me. She told me to cover up that drain. You mean that one? Wow. What a mess. <laughs> Indeed, Phoenix, that's a terrible job. I, I know. Why didn't she just put the drain back over and then tape it over? I'm not good with some... I'm not so good with handiwork. Some assistant, right? Yeah, but you do your own... You do work on the props and the backdrops, right? Right. Just lots of the times they end up looking worse than they did before, right? before I fixed them. Oh? Oh. Well, I'm sure these things happen. Nothing to worry yourself about. You're right. I won't. Personally, I think she should worry at least a little bit more. Um, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the guard station. I'm supposed to fill in for Miss Oldbag. Right. See you later, then. Good luck with your investigation. Oh, thanks, Peony. Let's, uh, check out this shoddy job that she did on this train. So, the fanboy they were talking about in the trial today, he came in through the train? So it seems. I guess they covered it in a hurry. Hey, hey, Nick. If that's the drain, if that drain's covered, the boy won't be able to get in. Uh, yeah. I think that was the idea. I feel kind of sorry for him, though. Don't you? What? You want to rip the grate off? Really, Nick? We can? Whoa. She's serious? Uh-oh. Yeah, rip it open. Why not? Well, I guess some things are just made to be broken. Yay! You know me, Nick. You're pretty swell sometimes. Sometimes? Hiya! There. That should make the kids happy. The things we do. And now they can also get into the murder scene and check out things. Hmm. Let's see. Uh. Can we go back into WP's room? Dressing room? Yeah, we can. What, anything going on here? Huh? Huh? Anything? This is where the Steel Samurai costume was on the day of the murder. That's what Mr. Powers says, at least. I guess they snuck in and took it while he was sleeping. But Nick, what if Mr. Powers hadn't been sleeping? I wonder what the killer was planning on doing then. Huh. She's got a point. That is true. Well, it looks like nobody's here, so... Let's take off. But I would like to question Miss Penny a little further. And she's at the main gate, right? Oh, hello. Oh, -ho! you look a little out of place. It's the clothes, isn't it? I thought my camo vest would do the trick. Kind of an alternate guard fashion thing. So, you can tell me about these fanboys, right? And the studios? Tell me about the studios. So, how are the studios doing? There's police wandering every around everywhere. It's terrible. They won't even let me clean up. Don't want me disturbing evidence. I haven't even cleaned up after the lunch plates from the day of the murder. You mean those plates with the steak bones left on them? Over? Uh -huh. The steak bones left over them on them in the employee area? Yeah. Can you believe it? I can't. Do, you, do kids sneak in here a lot? Well, I don't think there's that many of them, but I do see one in particular a bunch. He's always gawking at the sets or snapping pictures. You should see old windbags. Eyes flash when he sees them. She has a bit of a trouble catching him, though. Hmm. What about the director and the producer? I heard something on the trial today. They said that the director and producer were here on the day of the murder. Oh, sorry. I was in the prop storage room, so I didn't see them. I guess they were here, though. The studio head seemed pretty eager to keep us quiet. So, they were trying to protect the director? More the producer, really. The producer's really the re our real star here. She saved these studios from the brink of disaster and kept them running. I don't think we'd still be in business if it wasn't for the producer. The producer, huh? Sounds like some kind of big wig. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe... Let's see. Did we check out Studio 2 completely? Oh, something's going on now. This place is deserted. Crash! Hey, Nick, Nick, Nick! What was that noise? It sounded like it came from inside the trailer. Someone must be inside. H Hello? No answer. Pretty suspicious if you ask me, Nick. Let's go in. I'm not sure we should be barging in. Huh? It's locked. What? Don't we have a key? No. But there's probably one at the guard station, the main gate. And what are we waiting for? Let's borrow it! 
if they'll let us. Nope, oh, back to the main gate. Running around everywhere. Hey, hey, hurry, back to the main gate. Hurry, main gate. Uh, this one. Hey, 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 hey. Um, oh, I can't talk to you about it. Maybe I can just search the, uh, search the thing. You won't mind, right? The computer that runs the studio security cameras, huh? It looks like it's been turned off for the day. Huh. Okay, then. Hmm. 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 Can I just examine it? Security guard station. I can see the computer that runs security cameras. Oh, please don't touch anything in there. The security lady would knock the stuffing out of me if she knew. I really want that key to the trailer. Maybe next time. Hmm. Well, now what? Hmm. Let's see. I guess let's uh, wander around a little bit, see if we can find something. Ah, oh, we can go back to the detention center and ask Mr. Will Powers about it. About some things. Oh, Mr. Wright. Thank you for earlier. Not at all. We got lucky, to tell the truth. You could say that again. Let's well, not. So, WP. Do you have any leads that might get us going in the right direction? Hmm. S sorry, but no. Be sure to tell us anything that comes to mind, no matter how small. We can't rely on getting lucky again tomorrow. Y yes <laughs> He's always so sniffly. So, tell us about the fanboy. Do, uh, fanboys sneak into the studios often? No, not that I know of. That security lady's pretty strict with them. But, in today's testimony, did she say there was they were often hanging around? The kids really, really love the Steel Samurai. They sneak past when she's not looking, I guess. Hmm, tell me about this director. Was the director present at the morning run-through? Yes, yes he was. He was directing how the Steel Samurai and the Evil Magistrate should move. Why didn't you tell us that before? Well, well, just the studio asked us to keep quiet. That has nothing to do with this. I hate to repeat myself, but Nick, here is a newbie lawyer, fresh off the bar. When he loses, he's gonna lose big. I, I see. <laughs> Whose side is she on? You aren't hiding anything else from us, are you? No, I sure hope not. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything I could present in Mr. Will Bowers. Is this you in this photo? Regarding this photograph. Y yes This really, truly, absolutely isn't you, right? We're right. <laughs> I was sleeping in my dressing room the whole time. Honest. But who else could have worn it? Your costume was in the dressing room? Yes. I guess they snuck in and took it while I was asleep. But who? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, you didn't tell me about the Steel Samurai, or the Samurai Spear Break, regarding the murder weapon. Yes? Is it heavy, that spear? It's pretty hefty, yeah. I don't think the average person would be able to swing it around effectively. Hmm. And that's the spear that broke during the morning run-through? Oh yes, I goofed on a round kick, you see. I broke the spear. The security lady fixed it for me, though. Right away, though. With duct tape, we heard. Hmm. Well. Alright, then. I guess, uh, we can go show these things to Penny. Maybe she can tell us some things. Hey, Bean. I have some things for you. Tell me about the samurai spear. Say, you work with props, right? About that murder weapon. You mean the samurai spear? Yeah, it's a prop, but it's still pretty heavy. I hate having to carry that thing around. So you'd have to be pretty strong to use that as a weapon, it sounds like. Why is Mr. Powers the only person I can think of? Hmm. How about this photo? Could you take a look at this? That's Mr. Powers. Why is he dragging his leg like that? What is this, anyway? Looks like she didn't know about the photo or the injury that morning. Uh, never mind. Hmm. What about the card key? Wow, they gave a lawyer one of those card keys? Well, I'm sort of borrowing it. I see. You better be careful not to lose that. They're pretty strict about those card keys here. I guess they're pretty good about keeping those out out of outsiders' hands. Thanks for... Thanks, I'll be careful. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Let's check the employee area again. Hmm. Maybe the dressing room? Dressing room? WTF! Who are Jude dudes, Lamau? Huh? We... 
Wait, you first. Who are you? You look pretty suspicious to me. Whatever, lamers. How can you not know the great Sal Manella? I make Talit shows. The Steel Samurai? Mine. Read the effin' credits. Or film credits. But really? You're the Sal Manella? I I'm so sorry. I just... You, you look so sorry. No, no. Quite right. Really. It's fine. Raffle. I, I, I'm not... I'm kind of at a loss for words for this guy. What, what is it? You know, on closer inspection. Mmm, yeah. Hot, hot, hot. Kebabic. Hey, did you do a lot of cosplay? Because that costume rock zores. Drool. <laughs> rock zores? What, what, what? Hey, you're drooling. Huh? Hmm. Lol. Buffer overrun. Pant. You've triggered my creative powers. Yes. Yes, it's coming to me. Pink Princess! The sequel to the Steel Samurai. Pink Princess, Warrior of Little Old Tokyo. Oh my. Ruffle! Lamau! P Pink Princess? Why has it gotta be Little Old Tokyo? Why can't I have a cool name like Neil Old Tokyo? Maya, we really need to talk about cool. Hmm. So, who is this guy? This uber hexer guy? Tell me about the day of the crime. Did you notice anything unusual on the day of the murder? Oh, I know who you dudes are. That security lady told you about us, eh? That's right. It was a pretty regular day. We had a run-through on this action scene in the morning. Then, a meeting at lunchtime in the Studio 2 trailer. Heh, <laughs> I was so busy I didn't even get a chance to eat lunch. Some sad face emoticon. A T-bone steak, was it? Yeah, suck zores. I hate missing out on food. Nick. What does suck sores mean? I had no idea. Anyway, I was in the meeting from noon until four. With the producer and some bigwigs from the network. Mr. Hammer's time of death was estimated at 2.30. If he's telling the truth, that means it gives him an alibi. Hmm, tell me about the producer. About the producer? Who was at the meeting with you? Oh, you mean Dee Vasquez? She's a genius. Mad skills. All the way. Scary, though. Sweats. She brought, she brought these studios back from the brink of destruction. She's the one who made it possible for me to make the Steel Samurai. You had a meeting with her on the day of the murder, right? Yeah, we were together from noon to 4 p.m. the whole time. Hmm, tell me about the bigwigs. Who exactly are the bigwigs people you keep mentioning? Oh, the boss over there at the network and some sponsors. Also, a few production guys. They piled, on, piled into a limousine and got here right around noon. Major tension. <laughs> Were all of them with you the entire time? Yeah, unfortunately. They're all gray-haired geezers. <laughs> hmm. Sounds like they'd be really reliable witnesses. Hmm. So maybe you can tell me about some things that I'm going to show you here. Like the Steel Samurai thing. Huh. Oh, I try not to pay much attention to these things that don't interest me, lol. Just doing that tongue thing. Why are you staring at me like that? Stay away from my Maya. Don't don't even think about it. This is WP, right? How do you know? Well, look, he's obviously dragging his foot. All oh, right, the director would know about the injury. He he was there. Oh, so this guy is the director. I must have missed that part somewhere. Okay. Um. Hmm. I don't know what else to do with this guy. I don't think I have anything I can show him. Well, uh. It doesn't look like anything's changed. Okay. Um, I'll be going now to the employee area. Um, is there anything in here that I may have missed? Gotta look around. Let's examine the grate one more time. The drain grate is off, and I know who did it. Now the kids will be able to come again and again. Doesn't it make you feel great to do a good deed like that? Must be nice to live in so free of guilt. It's true. Hmm. Maybe Penny can tell me about some things. I don't know. Let's go see. Aha! You again? Eee! How rude. Acting like you've seen a ghost. You certainly got back quickly to your post. 
Oh, the police took me away, they did. They pulled out the spare steel samurai costume. Told me to put it on. Can you imagine? How could I? A sweet little old lady wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out for her being the murderer. Anyway, know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets a slight, a sight, or insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. You sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now. One, two, three. Mm. This lady's too much. Oh, let's talk anyway. Tell me about the fanboy, because you love him. Um, about that kid you saw. If I see him again, I'm taking him down. N Nick, look at her eyes. She's serious. Oh, God, she's mad. Look at her shoulders. That's intense. About the director, the one who was here on the day of the murder? If I see him again, I'm taking him down! <laughs> Nick, I think she's looking at it. Oh, Jesus. Um, maybe I can present you something to calm your ass down. About this photo. I have a feeling she's not going to respond well to anything I show her now. Um, did you fix this? No, okay. Um, hmm. wonder if I can just uh, get that thing. Security card station, I can see the computer that runs the security cameras. Hey, no touching. Guess I better investigate that there later. Hmm. So I know someone's in the studio too, or at least I think someone's in the studio too. Huh. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Uh, play area. Hey! Hey, wait! I'll bet he came in through that drain. Hey, um, kiddo. What's your name, sport? I'm not a kid, so don't talk to me like that. Huh? But you... you are a kid. What a rude little brat. There's no way to talk to an adult. I don't see no adults around here. Hippie fashion chick. Hi hippie fashion? Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You gotta hand it to Amaya. She's pretty sharp. And pretty mad. I'm Cody. Cody Hackins. Call me kiddo again, and I'll cut you down where you stand, evil doer. Whoa. He's got some kind, of, some kind of sword there. So, he must be the fanboy that's been sneaking in. So, you're the fan. You're a fan of the Steel Samurai? How dare you utter that name, evil doer? What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side. Ha ha! Ha ha! You can't fool me. Okay. Then what's the last line in the, in the innkeeper? What's the last line said by the innkeeper in Episode Eight? Ha! Easy. Like, want some fries with that? Hmm. <laughs> Not bad, kiddo. Kiddio. Watch it. What are they doing? Um, what happened? So, you heard anything about the incident the other day? You were here, weren't you? Did you see anything? He, he... Always! The Steel Samurai always wins! Always! Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But... But no way I'm telling you losers. What? Wait. Let me go. Oh. He's gone. Huh. Something feels off of the table that he bumped into on his way out. Oh, something fell off. A bottle? Why is it sitting there, I wonder? Why are we taking an empty bottle? Weren't people just... Yeah. Anyway. What was that kid saying? He saw everything? Oh. Let's see. I want to look at this bottle. Sleeping pills. Sleeping pills? Oh. Oh. Well, that just, just made everything a lot more interesting, didn't it? The way well, he actually wanted to take a nap. Huh? Where's that old windbag? Ought of her to lead her post. H hey! Nick! That was her! So stop! Whippersnapper! Yeah, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. Natch! Uh-oh, she tripped. Ma Maya sure looks happy. <laughs> I would be too. That lady is quite the biatch. Hey, hey, Nick. Now's our chance. Let's check out the guard station. Good idea. 
Oh! This is it, Nick. The trailer key. The key to the trailer in Studio 2. We'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? Alright. Now we got them keys. Let's, uh... Guess go back to Studio 2 and open it up. And see what was making that crashing sound. Oh, I'm nervous. Not really. But I'm curious, at least. Uh, outside Studio 2. Um... Move? Can we move to it? No, we can't. I guess we have to examine it first. Examine the trailer. I wonder if this key we borrowed from the guard station will work. It opened! Great! Let's go, Nick! She seems eager all of a sudden. Well, you first, Nick! Ah, uh, not that eager. Yep. Gotta let the dude go first, because when there's someone in there, and they want to grab at her hippie clothes, and then I have to sock him one. Studio 2 trailer. It doesn't look too shabby in here. Oh, hello, smoking lady. Eek! Somebody's here! Names. Uh, our names? Um, we're WP's lawyers, and, um... I see. A and you might be... D. Vasquez, the producer. D. Vasquez. She's quite beautiful. If you're into that sort of thing, I guess. Um, can we talk about the day of the crime? I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder. Um, Miss Vasquez? Script. Uh, excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. Uh, a sc script? Steel Samurai Episode 13. I need it. Um... Can we ask you a little bit of the day of the murder? I need to read it. We're getting nowhere fast. <laughs> That's how I'm feeling. Uh, you, you, you want to talk about the Steel Samurai a little bit, maybe? Maybe. Uh, um, we really like to ask you about something about the Steel Samurai, Miss Vasquez. It's on TV every week. That's all I have to say about it. Nick, she's telling us to go watch TV? The nerve of her. Hey, don't get mad at me. Um, I guess talk about the awesome director dude that was drooling all over my, uh, assistant here. About the director. Salmonella, was it? What are, exactly is his role here? Perhaps I didn't make myself clear? I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. Wow, she keeps just taking hits off that pipe. Nick? Are all the people in the entertainment business this weird? It's all starting to look like it. Oh, don't cry, Maya. Nick, let's get out of here. Isn't there some place we have to we have to check? Uh, yeah. Wait. Y yes? If you see Manella, give him this. Well why do we have to do your errands? I I don't think I like her. Don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. Alright. Let's give it to him, if we see him. Vasquez's memo. Can I read the memo? Oh, God, I don't want to read that memo. See what's going on with that memo. Memo? Bring me the script to episode 13. Okay, that's all it says. I bet it says, like, all those things that stationery usually says. Oh, I don't want to present or anything. It's like, from the desk of D. Vasquez. Bring me the script. Signed, D. Vasquez. Alright, um, he was in the, um, outside studio one. He was in the employee area, I believe, in the dressing room from WP. Uh, yeah, this place is kind of becoming amazed to me. Oh, yeah, we gotta go to the main gate. From the main gate to the employee area. And from the employee area to the dressing room. It's like a giant flowchart. Jesus. Hey. Hey, guy. I like your little, your little top knot there. Here's a, here's a memo. Here, I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring the script for episode 13? Episode 13? Where did I put that one? Must have left it somewhere. Uh, uh oh. My ass is pwned if I don't find it. Yeah, it's shaking noises, I guess. <laughs> Nick. It might be quick just to look into all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. Aw, oh, man, but I've been so many places! Eh. Alright.
right. Let's see. Um. Hmm. What's maybe? Did he leave it in there? It looks like there's some folders there. Uh -huh. Huh? No clues here. Okay. Maybe put it in the trash. Let's see. Cola, candy, chips, gum. Hmm. It's so normal. I was expecting some school theme snacks or something. Popcorn, at least. But wait, look. Samurai soda. Nick, try this. Be my guest. Okay. Oh, too bad it's sold out. Huh. I wonder what flavor samurai is. Um, to the main gate. Um, uh, I don't think it's here. It's, uh, maybe left in Studio One. That would make sense. Oh, the director's chair, of course. We're back at the scene of the crime. Let's find what we need and get out of here. Quick, Nick. Quick, Nick. Yeah, I thought I saw that. Like, I, I saw this folder last time, and it didn't have anything. I guess that's the thing we need. Hey, look! That's the chair the director sits in. I've always wanted to sit in one of these. The director? Maya. Take a look around that chair for me, would you? Remember the script the director was talking about? Didn't he say he left it somewhere? Aha! Found it, Nick. The script. Good work. Alright. That was a lot easier than I expected. Let's see. Now we gotta go take this Miss D. Vasquez. Be like, here's your script. Because your memo asked for it. And we are very good assistants. And you can hire us. And give us all sorts of money. And I can quit being a lawyer. Hello again. You are going to get cancer. I have a script. Here, we found it. Your script. Ah, oh. script handed to D. Vasquez. Um, uh, you're not going to talk to us? Quiet. I'm reading. Mm-mm. Just you hold on. What's the big idea? Who do you think you are anyway? And, and do you even know who we are? Powers is lawyers. Um, right. Oh, so I, I guess she was listening. Am I a suspect? No, no, it's just, well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Y yes. Anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know, there was a meeting here at noon. Yes, with the director and the people from the network. Correct. Now, listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon went to Studio One. It was impossible it was possible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The path? Oh yeah, that tree was cut down, huh? Tell me some things, now that you want to talk. On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? You saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? That is correct. M m mr Monkey? The monkey with the broken head. Oh, right, that. Oh, wow, what an original name. Its head fell over in the wind on the, fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. They didn't start moving the head out of the way until a little after three. It was after four by the time the bat plat bat <laughs> It was by the time the bath was unblocked. Capiche? Everyone in the trailer was stuck here until the path was cleared. Stuck in this trailer? Stuck until after four. Hammer died at through two thirty. Thus, none of us could have gone to the Studio One. But what? It's true. A crane just came in three to move the head. We called some people in to clear the path. I'm sure they collaborate with my story. But but wait! What if the head fell over after 2.30? Then you could have gone to Studio One. 2.30. Slam the death. Very well. Come. That's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it announced the time in ooks. One ook per hour. Ook, 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 ook. Always with the ooking. It is a monkey, after all. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. Hmm. <laughs> Nick, it stopped at 2.15. 2.15. That's right. This path was blocked from 2.15 until 4. And therefore, we're innocent. Mr. Hammer died in Studio One at 2.30. See? Goodbye. 
Hmm. Mr. Monkey Data. What do we do now, Nick? There isn't anyone besides WP who could have killed the hammer. It's over. We're finished. It sure does it sure doesn't look good. Guess we should try to head back to the office and plan our strategy. Okay. If you say so, Nick. To the Rat and Cole offices. October 18th, Rat and Cole offices. Now, what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early to give up, don't you think? Oh, is that who I think it is? Huh? You've got one lead. M Mia, it's you! What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Right. Oh, wait. I guess that means we're really in trouble. I'd say so. What did you mean? Do we have one lead? The boy, of course. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But, but no way I'm telling you losers. I don't know. He doesn't, he didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. Either way, we should get back to the studios. That boy must be hard as our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. Now I'm more worried than ever than I was before. I will say this, that Maya's uh, costume is quite revealing on Mia. Just saying. So, uh, old bag, did you uh, happen to catch that boy? <laughs> What's wrong? Whippersnapper! snapper! She's been chasing that boy the whole whole time. When when I catch him, I she's not like she has any luck catching him. I got the hostage now, Whippersnapper. snapper! A hostage? Whoa, 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 whoa! Not examine. But please tell me about this hostage. What the heck's going on? Um, what happened with, to the boy? If I see him again, ah, again, ah, lay him flat. <laughs> My, what a violent old lady. Oh, Mia's still here. I'm, uh, I'm kind of happy for that. All right. Actually, I met with the director just now. Eh? Ah, my heart. I don't feel so good. Is she going? Is she okay? But before I go, I'd like to visit the place where poor, poor Hammer died. Right. She was saying she wanted to visit the studio where he died? Uh, tell me about the hostage she got. What's this about a hostage? <laughs> when that boy was running away, he dropped this and ran. <laughs> He'll come back. <laughs> For this one. It's kind of hard to understand with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might be what we need. Cody might talk to us if we gave him that. Good idea. Miss Oldbeck, might I? No! I'm catching that Brad if the last thing I do. Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? A trade? Hmm. I wonder. Do I have anything that I can trade with her? I can get something out of you. Let's see. Uh. Uh, I got this bottle. How about the keys? You want your keys? Soul bag. I'm borrowing this, just to let you know. Oh, okay. <laughs> just be sure to give it back. She's not demanding when she's exhausted. Huh. Uh, empty bottle of sleeping pills? <laughs> she's too busy catching her breath to tell me anything. Uh, you want this card key? Hey, that. <laughs> That's a card. Uh, studio One? Right. A card key to Studio One. I, I could visit poor Ham- Oh, right. Okay. Give the card key so she can go. Alright. I'd like to visit. He died. I was his, his fan. You don't have to- You don't have your own card, Miss Oldbag? Studio One isn't my turf. You'll let me borrow. Borrow it then. If I give her the card key, I won't be able to get in the Studio One. Huh. I don't think there's anything else in there for- There you go! Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. 
Here you go, Miss Oldbag. Car key lent to Miss Oldbag. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having debts with no whippersnappers. You take this, and we're even. Deal? What's this? A steel samurai trading card? That sneaky kid dropped it. I figured it's pretty important to him, though. Thank you. I may have use for this. This must be the hostage she was talking about. Oh, okay, so it's not actually a person. I, that would have been horrible. Right, I'm off. There she goes, hobbling towards to the studio. Well, uh, I guess the kid's going to be in the employee area because that's where we saw him last, so. Okay, I think so. Employee area. There he is. Hey! Hey, you. Wait a second. Phoenix. Was that the boy? Yeah. His name is Cody's Hack Cody's Hackins. I think he ran to the dressing room. Well, time to follow him. Into the... Ah, oh, damn it. I pushed the wrong button. Well, back to the employer. And then back to the, um... Dressing room. Global Studios dressing room. He's sure to be in here somewhere. Found you! Damn it! He's getting away! Come back! There. He's back. <laughs> well, that was easy. How did she? Hey there. Would you mind helping us out? Please? I I'm Cody. Hi, Cody. I'm Mia. Mia Faye. Nice to meet you. Yo! And I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? Phoenix. You can take it from here. I'm not so sure I'm qualified. I think Cody is a fan of the Blue Bitch, and that's why he's all very compliant with Miss Miefe. Hey, I got your Steel Samurai cards back. Cody, does this look familiar? Hey, my you are. You are, huh? You are, you know, ultra rare. The card's really hard to get. Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. I'll give you this if you help me. But that's my card. Offering me something I already own, you're in effect a skewing of the very basis of my consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade. Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. But what do they even teach these kids in school these days? Quantum physics? Whatever. I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Just keep it. It's yours. What? After all, I went through all that trouble? If you want to trade, find me a really rare card. Really rare? You mean there's something rarer than ultra rare? Ultra rare premium cards are the way way rarer than plain ultra rare cards. Come on, man! For grown up, you sure are dumb. Premium rare? Why do I feel like we're talking about steaks? Huh? So uh, maybe I can just chit chat with him. Ah, let's try. Um, still samurai is so cool. I think he he's the um uh, the bomb. Ha. Huh. What would a lamer like you know about the Steel Samurai? But hey, watch that ad too. Phoenix, you really shouldn't yell like that. He's only a kid. Yeah, don't yell like that. I'm only a kid. Ugh. This kid's playing the system pretty good. So, do you know anything about what happened here? Could you tell me, please? I don't know nothing. Hmm. Looks like a little persuasion is necessary. Maybe a bribe? Uh, but the only thing I have is the Steel Samurai cards. You sure you don't... You sure you don't want these? Cody. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is all the same. You heard this. Oh, well, this kid's... I don't know what to do. Um, I guess we're leaving, then. Hmm. Uh, back to the main gate. Uh, uh... Maybe there's something going on with Miss Vasquez in Studio Report 2, I think it was. Yeah, let's try, let's check. Oh, Miss Vasquez, do you have any ultra rare premium cards that you may be able to give me? Please? Studio 2 trailer. Oh, hi. Hello. What brings you here? Oh, well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um. Yes? Um, the girl you were with, doesn't she seem a little different? Like, is she even the same person as before? Um, nope. She's the same as always. Same as always. Okay. Whatever you say. Um, 
in stock. Tell me about the van. Have you seen the fan? Have you seen that boy since then? Nope. You missed it though. The security lady was chasing around him after that boy so fast. I thought she'd collapse. Of course, he got away in the end. Boy, was she mad. Actually, we saw them. How is how's the old windbag doing? She was sneezing donuts through her clenched fist back at the card station. Oh, squeezing. Sorry, not sneezing. Then that, that would be silly. Some people take their jobs a little too seriously. Um, tell me about Mr. Hammer. Are all the posters on the wall here of Hammer? Yes. It's really a terrible loss for the studio. But its popularity had been waning recently, right? That's true. Then again, after what happened. After what happened? You mean you don't know about Hammer? No, what? I I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. Oh yeah, it was, just, it was it old bag said that Hammer had an accident and something happened. Wait, now you have to tell me. What happened with Hammer? I I'm sorry. I'm probably not the one who should tell you. Uh oh, why do I get the feeling something's being covered up here? Uh, hmm. Do you, are you do you like Steel Samurai cards? Do you do you want this? You, you are this ultra rare? Because you seem like kid. Do you know anything about this? Hey, that's a Steel Samurai trading card. I collect those actually. I'm one card away from a complete set. A complete set? Yeah, a set of one of each card. Huh. Wait. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. That's it. That's the card I need. You don't know how long I've been looking for it. Uh, I don't care what kind of girl you think I am. I need that card. But please, I beg you, please trade with me. T trade with you? Yes, trade cards. Look, I'll even trade you an ultra rare premium card. Trade me a... Huh? Yes, it's a good deal. You're ultra rare. Please. Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? What's everyone getting so exciting about? Uh, yeah, trade, because it's a good trade. Okay, really? So thanks. Then this is for you. You are a P-card. Yahoo! And then there she goes. Just doing good things make you feel great. Yeah, yeah it does. I helped a girl complete her trading card collection. I'm the best. So now we got that ultra rare, or ultra premium rare, I guess. We can go give that to Cody Hackins. And then he'll be so happy. Uh, main gate. And then employee area. And then dressing room. And then ultra rare premium card. And then he'll talk to us. Hey, kiddo, with your top knots and your swords and your camera, have the URP card. See this card? Yeah, so wait! That's it. That's the last ultra rare premium card I need. Come on, give it to me, please. You gotta give it to me. Wow, I've never seen him so eager. Right, okay, how about a trade? You're on. I'll give you a samurai spear and throw in an evil magistrate to boot. No, 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 no. Not that kind of trade. I don't want cards. I want information. Huh? You sure? Fine by me. Gave you RP card code. Okay, Phoenix, let's hear what he has to say. If you know something that could help us out, we have to take him to the stand tomorrow. Alright, you could be a potential witness, kid. Tell me about the Steel Samurai. So, you like the Steel Samurai? He's so cool! I, I guess. If you're judging him by his looks, you don't have to look at his action. You have to look at his actions, at his life. I'm being lectured on life by a great scholar. You look like him too, don't ya? You like him too, don't ya? Uh, oh me? Y yeah, I um, love the Steel Samurai. So, tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. Uh... His fighting skills, cause you're a boy and I think you like fighting things. You got some, yeah, I think so. I like when he uh, vanquishes his foes. Yeah, wazam! The Steel Samurai always wins, always! Check this out, it's my fan album. What the? And it's all the pictures of the Steel Samurai. I go to every live performance. Those stupid publicity stumps where they beat each other up in public. I always take a picture when I'm when Steel Samurai lands the final blow. Wazam! I got them all. I never missed one. Missed one. A perfect collection. Wait a minute. Maybe he has a photo of Jack Hammer getting stabbed with the samurai spear. Check it out. My new digital camera. Well, 
That's very impressive. The newest model, isn't it? You bet, lady. I just got it for my birthday. My album has a name. Wanna hear it? The Steel Samurai. Path to glory. Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Hey, if you want this, you can have it, lady. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, I took these with a digital camera. I got them all the data at home, so I can always make another one. Well, then I'm happy to accept. Thank you. Man, Mia's really good with children. What's all these people giving stuff to Mia? What a life! It's because she's gosh darn so pervy. So tell me what happened. You were here on the day of the uh, incident, right? Of course, yeah. Did you see anything unusual? Cody? Cody, he needs to know because he's fighting for justice. Isn't that the Steel Samurai's motto? For great justice? You have to help us fight for great justice too. I, I saw, I saw everything. Well, well. I might get some useful information out of him, yeah. Tell us what you saw. Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around too. I had to come in through the woods out back so the old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost though. I was in there for maybe half an hour or so. Then, I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? The, the Steel Samurai killed the bad guy. He used the Samurai Spear. Just like always, one shot, one kill. It happened so fast. I got scared. I went home after that. I, I, I see. It must have been hard for you. Man, you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you aren't speaking from the heart. Um, right. Mia? Yes? I think we can say for sure that this means the Steel Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So, the only person left who could have been is Will Powers. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. If you put this boy on this witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Let's not call him then. I think that would be wise. Best to leave this one alone. Not so fast, pal! Oh shit! I heard everything. This boy here is a key witness. And he's under police protection starting now. Come on, son. You've got so you got a rendezvous with me at the precinct. No! I ain't going! Wah! That didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. And now we have a serious handicap in court. But what are we gonna do, Mia? Well, hmm. I really need to be going. Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa! C come to the trial tomorrow, please! I need you there. Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe in Mr. Powers is innocent? Yeah, I always believe in your client. Of course he is! That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Great. Thanks, Mia. See you soon.